Good morning, Marmy. Today is Sunday, October 21st. We are at the pumpkin patch to take pictures, and you guys know how paranoid I am about coming to the pumpkin patch after like a scary thing that happened to us many years ago. But I'm just gonna start this vlog, get outside. Our photographer is meeting us to do some pictures, and then I think I'll probably swap over to iPhone footage so I can get some footage of us without having to carry my camera around. I'll see how it goes. Um, yeah, but before we get into the whole day, if you're new to my channel, my name is Tina, I'm the mom of three. I put out videos here on YouTube three times a week. I hope you'll consider subscribing and joining the Marmy. So we are actually freezing, and you guys will notice that this is a family vlog on a Wednesday, and I decided to do a bonus vlog this week because the vlog that you guys saw on Monday was of me in San Francisco, and so I thought just a little bit of family time would be good this week. So that's why I'm adding an extra vlog. Let's take you along on a little quick trip to the farm. Very frustrated, and angry. Like when I'm walking behind him, he's like, "Go away, mom!" Like he's getting really mad. I think he wants to go home if he's cold. We did barely any pictures. We were just like, "Whatever, let's just get what we can and let them enjoy the farm." Ajith and I were freezing, came to the car, and now I'm eating pumpkin dough inside Ajith's eating cookies. Ajith, say hello. Say hello. <gasps> the car's not on. No one freak out. He's just sitting in the front with me. Can you say hello? Hello. I'm <laughs> the car. And I'm eating my cookies. Did you hear that? Hello, I'm in the car. I'm eating my cookies. This kid's a vlogger. Here, Ajith. Here's your cookie. Here's your cookie. <gasps> Now I'm saying, mmm, delicious. No, he's chill now. What did you get? Do you want to show everyone your tractor? Where's your tractor? Mm -hmm. yeah, I bought another tractor toy. We don't need any more tractor toys. Can you show everyone your tractor? Mm -hmm. No, it's right here. Mm -hmm. Very nice. Mm -hmm. What color is it? Red tractor. Red tractor. Yeah, I don't know what was going on. He was just really upset. And then in the end, I think, because I was trying to hold his hand to keep him up, he was crying. He was hurting because he's just, it's so, I can't believe how cold it is outside. It's freezing. I mean, I knew it was going to be cold. That's why we brought our winter coats. I like iron dress shirts for the kids, put them on. I was thinking, like, I know it knew it was going to be cold, but, like, if I can just quickly in, like, two minutes get a family shot done, like, in that shirt, then I had sweatshirts to go on top of it so we could do a couple of sweatshirts, and then their winter coats on top. We only could do their winter coats. Like it was, it's so cold. Like my hands are frozen. We've been here for a while. I called. I was watching uh, Ajith for the last little bit. I, I called Harper. And I was like, "Listen, I'm taking him out. I'm going to the gift shop, buying pumpkin donuts. Then I'm going to the car because it's way, way, way too cold. Like we need like snow pants and full thick gloves and stuff. We were gonna be out here, and I was, even though I'm wearing my winter coat, like even I'm freezing. My my hands are freezing. Everything. And the kids are just wearing their winter coats. They had hoods and stuff. And actually, Ajit wouldn't let me put his hat on him. He was like throwing a big, having a big meltdown about it. He was wearing his hood, like for a sweatshirt and a hood for his coat. But still, like it's just, it's so cold today. The wind is so intense. So we're back home. And my boys, we got their YouTube kid sweaters on. Come here, let's see you do a jump in the YouTube kid sweater. Can we see a jump? Whoa. Yeah, let's see. Whoa. Let me see your, let me see, Jita, let me see how strong you are with your YouTube kid sweater. Let's see. Whoa, careful guys. Yeah. Who are you telling this stuff? Who are you telling me stuff? Yeah. Whoa, good one guys. So there's all kinds of stuff going on. They're making some kind of track for their cars over here with some cardboard and paper. Jita, say hello. I'm sitting with my dada. Jita, uh, Jita, say five little monkeys. 
Five little monkeys jumping on the bed. Bye. One fell off and bumped his head. Mama called the doctor and the doctor said, No more Jeet Singhs jumping on the bed. <laughs> so, Harper, are we going to do date night this week? This week? Maybe, if we'll try this. We're going to be, you know what the topic is? Whenever it's happening? Is dad guilt a real thing? Is dad guilt a real the thing? thing? Yeah. We'll talk about it then, but that's what the topic. Guilt? What is it? So you don't even know what it is, so what am I supposed to say? Yeah, it doesn't exist. No, it might exist. Are you car good. ready? Like, they say, uh, you know, moms have mom guilt going everywhere. They feel Let like, oh... Go get it. I can't even speak. Let's just talk later. Yeah, I think it is a real thing. Okay, but let's talk about it. We're going to talk about it. For a Friday video. And stop checking yourself out. This guy. My skin looks so clear in this. Though. Yeah, there's a camera magic. My skin is not this great. Look at it. <laughs> it's so bright and, like, lovely. Hello. Good morning, Marmy. Look how nice and wet your teeth are. It's all camera tricks, my friends. We're like here looking all bus up, bruck up. So it's like almost eight. We finished up bath time. Kids had a really late dinner. Like they just ate dinner now. And even then, like I made them like, like egg and cheese sandwiches, kind of. I had nothing prepared. I got late. They ended up having lunch late because of the time we got home from the farm. Actually, one of my mom's relatives stopped by as well, like my mom's cousin's daughter. Um, so my mom's first cousin's daughter. She's usually in Utah, but she was in town. I've never met her, but she just stopped by for a couple minutes to meet us and stuff, which was so nice. Like she, they were only here for like 20 minutes. Her, her husband, and her younger son, she has an older son as well that was not uh, with them today. But um, yeah, it was nice. It's nice to meet people. Like I said, my mom's like first cousin's daughter, and I'm, I'm like, I've never met her, so... It was nice, so we got kind of busy with that. As soon as they found out they were coming, I mean, they were here for such a short period of time, but still, I had to at least tidy a little. I mean, I don't know how tidy it looked, but I tried my best. The kids were like in the bath, like and I was washing their hair, like when my mom called saying that they wanted to pop by. And of course, like I mean, they're only here for another two days. I'm like, yes, sure, we're, we're both home, come, come by. So yeah, we got late for dinner, so they, <laughs> they got egg sandwiches for dinner, whatever. Um, my eyelashes are really, really bothering me. Like, I don't know if you can see it. Like one of them, this one, I have so many lashes, right? This one, I have like none. I put on eyeliner today to kind of hide that fact because it looked really weird. Um, I usually don't wear eyeliner when I have like these lashes because um, taking it off is a pain and you end up losing like a bunch of the lashes. Now I don't care. Now I feel like it's just, it's just too much of a difference. I could get them filled, but I just find it so difficult. And actually next month, I'm going on another trip. <laughs> I told you guys, and that one is like a beach trip. It's only two days, but it's a beach trip. Uh, I'll tell you more about it later on, but for that, it's like I wouldn't want eyelashes for that. And that's like three weeks away, three or four weeks away. Um, actually, yeah, almost a month away. Um, so I don't think I'd get them filled again. I mean, they'd probably be gone by then even if I did. It just, they're not being able to wash my face and stuff. I can only stand this for a certain amount of time. You need to just like rub my eyes and not have to think twice about it. Like I, I don't like that kind of stuff. So for me, I think I can only take it in small doses. I could get them filled now, but I'm lazy, I don't want to, <laughs> forget it. So I'm just gonna like, maybe use an oil-based product. I don't know what I can use, I'll have to Google it and just like see if I can take some off from this eye so it's not so drastically different. Like there's so many lashes, I don't even know if you can see it, so many lashes versus like hardly any left. I'm sure you can't even tell on the camera, but that's the situation. So Sunday night, I'm just gonna comb the kids' hair, get off to bed, and hopefully Harper and I will have a little bit of downtime. Last night we tried to get a little bit of work done so we didn't have to do that much work tonight. My vlog for tomorrow morning is done. It's the one from San Francisco. You guys saw it uh, on Monday. I'm gonna maybe try to edit this vlog for Wednesday so that I'm ahead of the game. And like you heard, I'm gonna try on Friday to do a date night video. So if I got everything else done, then I can hopefully grab Harper for a couple of spare minutes and we can, we can uh, try to get it done. So anyways, I hope you had fun joining us today. And if you did join us again next time, if you enjoy our vlogs and videos, subscribe to our channel and stay well. Join the Marmy. March on, Marmy.